Presidential spokesperson Harry Roque says he asked officials of the Boracay Task Force to give media covering the island's closure more freedom during coverage. The task force had earlier announced that media workers would only be allowed inside Boracay from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. during the six-month closure. Media will be required to spend their nights outside the island and would have to be accompanied by escorts while in Boracay. Roque says, quote, I do agree that media does not sleep and that, of course, a comparison was made between Boracay and Marawi. I said there are no improvised explosive devices in Boracay. He adds one of the suggestions was to provide media cards to journalists so they can be treated as residents of the island. Based on the guidelines, the accreditation of television networks will be limited to a maximum of 12 people, while the accreditation for radio, print, wire agencies, and online platforms will be limited to a maximum of 5 people. Issues have been raised about the constitutionality of the media restrictions, with legal experts saying it can be considered prior restraint.